Jessica walks with us. She has the magic key when it comes to gardening. Uh, we know her from Carmelita from ABC's primetime drama, Dirty Sexy Money, now sharing her love for all things gardening. It's a brand new show. Uh, Candace Kane is here. Candace, nice to see you. So nice to see you. So you were saying pandemic, we've all got time on our hands and suddenly yeah. you figured. I was so bored and I, I, I love gardening. And I looked at my garden and I started collecting aloes. Like I have, I kind of got obsessed with them. I have like a hundred different species of aloe. Wow. Oh wow, I didn't even know there were that many species yeah. of aloe. There's yeah. like 700 actually. Okay. Oh, um, and so I kind of decided I wanted to do a garden show and then my writing partner, uh, Deanna Davis was like, girl, let's add some magical creatures in there. <laughs> so <laughs> Bruce, 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 Bruce Lanch is in the garage. <laughs> yes. yes. <laughs> um, and so I started doing makeovers and uh, and we had a bunch of magical creatures that live in my garden. All right, how fun. And, <laughs> and did you just, and you know, sometimes people front shows and have great knowledge and sometimes people front shows and don't. Are you knowledgeable about this stuff now? I am. And and I've always gardened, been interested in plants. I, you know, I'm not a botanist. Right, right. Um, but I have always, I come from Maui and, and just, and there's so much lushness around me um, growing up, so. I just, I wanted to do something and I saw this opportunity and I wanted to show people how to create their own secret garden. What's the easiest thing we could start with? What can we not that, mess that, up? Yeah, that we yeah. can't screw up. Probably succulents. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Especially in our climate. <laughs> right. right. You know, aloes, succulents. But I've even cactus. killed a succulent. I, have. <laughs> oh, I yeah. really have. Yeah. That's Which hard. is kind of impossible to do. Well, you know, it, it is funny because those, quote, I, I initially was not a fan of these zero scapes. Yeah. But now I think people have done really good jobs with them. They, they can look really good. Yeah, my garden looks like it's a tropical rainforest nice. and it's all with water cons conservative plants. Mm. I water in the summer once a week. Oh, wow. And it's, oh. it looks lush. You can do it here. Okay. And so I, I, I approached uh, Kristen Carroll and Jacqueline Chesson, who's a film, uh, cinematographer, and we just started filming it and then Advocate uh, Channel picked it up. Oh wow! And then you were saying th uh, uh, that you do garden makeovers. I do. So you'll go to somebody's backyard and do what? So uh, I went to one house and it was a total disaster. Weeds everywhere. We got the weeds out. I picked and and I created a look. It was a, a zero scape kind of garden, and we have before and afters on the show, and so you can see what has what has been created. I really wanted everybody to have their own secret garden, especially yeah. someplace that they can go in and, and relax and, you know, yeah. refresh Fresh. themselves. And it, I know the pandemic was really hard for a lot of people. And I was so blessed to be able to have something that I could do to, to take my mind off of everything. Yeah. And I got really bored and, you know, being an actress, and then, you know, the strike and everything, I, I just wanted something to, to do. And so that's how it all kind we've of We've got We've about. got a trailer for the show, and it might include a uh, libation or two. Wow. <laughs> Rain had told me that she wanted some shade from the sun. And so along one side, I planted hedges, which are going to grow eventually up. And then I decided to go with the little purple section with her plums that she had here. What a fantastic way to start my birthday. So today, I'm going to do a fabulous little cocktail called the Buzzy Bee. This is really so easy to do at home. Let me show you. I could do this all day. You're talking greenhouse, red mary. What else would I be talking about, succulent? <laughs> <laughs> These are the sort of the big characters that just appear. Yeah, that's Mr. Hammer. All right. <laughs> uh, understandably. All right, what was the beverage you were talking about? Oh, a Buzzy Bee. Okay. Mm. Yeah, um, it has, uh, well, I, I can't remember. <laughs> I can't remember the ingredients. Probably honey. Maybe you've had I do, honey yeah, it's definitely okay. honey, um, some vodka and some Spritzer. I do a cocktail segment. Um, we call it Flower Hour every episode. Oh well, yeah. see, they're, they're very important. <laughs> uh, you've got a production company and uh, have obviously made a lot of strides as a, a, a trans actress. Uh, what's the production company up to? It's called Mary's Mary Productions. Uh, we started it over the pandemic. I wanted to, you know, have a place where I could make trans relevant content and. Uh, we are writing shows, filming shows, and pitching shows. So, there. I mean, it's a, it's, it's a business. That's you know? a, that, the, the, the pitch is the, is the thing that makes everything else happen. And Secret Garden is our first show that's actually 
here. Here, so, here yeah. we go. It is called Candace Kane's Secret Garden. It is on the Advocate channel. New episodes drop on Thursdays. Thanks for joining us today. Thanks, Thanks Candace. Thanks so much.